The Corso clowns have been successfully bringing a smile to the faces of sick children in hospitals all over Italy, as well as abroad for the past 15 years. Vladimir Olshansky, co-founder of the program, explained to us the ins and outs of becoming a clown and how this project is an indispensable one for the country. The Russian-born clown actor graduated from Moscow's circus school before working as a clown in Russia for a few years. Clown school for me is, uh, was very important because I always actually w w w was going to be an in, uh, in actor in a dramatic repertoire, but by accident. So I, <laughs> I become a clown. I love clown, actually, always. I, uh, but it was like a way of my acting career, which just led me to clown circus school. Uh, in Moscow Circus School and I become a clown. Uh, it's my, my pro profession, I dedicate my life to this profession and uh, I just really want to tell you know the audience and the uh, general people that clowning is not a fun, it is a real profession and it's very difficult actually, complicated profession and I consider this profession as a, a top of performing arts profession. Escaping the communist regime, he emigrated to New York in 1988, where he began working with circus director Michael Christiansen, the founder of the first ever Clown Doctor organization. Professional clown doctors began working in hospitals under a program called the Big Apple Circus Clown Care Unit, which was started by Michael Christiansen in New York City. Clown doctor programs now operate throughout Australia the United States, Canada, Israel and all over Europe. Here at the Meyer Hospital in Florence, clown doctors attend to the psychosocial needs of hospitalised children and in some cases adults too. They parody the hospital routine to help children adapt to their surroundings, distracting them from and demystifying painful or frightening procedures. The atmosphere of fun and laughter can help children forget about their illnesses and their stress of the hospital surroundings for a moment or two. When I do my master class, a lot of people come and say, oh, I want to be clown, I want to be clown. Unfortunately, uh, it's not everyone can be clown. Clown is not a mascara de carnavale, I, I say, like this. So it's, uh, it's very easy to imitate to be a clown, to, be, you know, to put some makeup and uh, you look like a clown. But clown, it's a, it's, a, it's a form of dramatic art and uh, you need to know a lot of things. So, uh, who is a clown? Clown is an actor with a comic gift first. So, actor, so person with ability of acting and comic gift can be clown.